All right, guys, welcome back to Heat Death Survival Train. Hopefully you're doing well. And I just want to thank you for the uh, love and support on the first part. So I thought I'd throw one out a little quicker than I was expecting to. Um, and right now, as you can tell, we're going backwards from the compound where we ended on the last, stream, uh, the last stream, the last video. That is because when I was editing the video, and some of you guys commented in the comments as well, saying, Bits, you missed a blueprint. Literally, it was the first room we walked into when we was at this first city, this compound we was at. And it was next to, uh, and there's a logbook in there as well, uh, which is where we um, went into the power generation room. So we're going to head back there right now. Uh, quickly go and pick them up because obviously I don't know if there's going to be duplicate blueprints um, So we're gonna head back there collect that and head on our way because we have got the items from that compound What I might do whilst I'm here. I might as well just grab some uh, materials that this bot down here might have collected uh, And uh, we need to keep, keep, keep an eye on the power here as well, right? Uh, yeah, we, we need to charge up before we move on which I want to see if this building here is going to charge my engine um and I, i'm just wondering if if it's worth making a second engine here uh, or something so we are kind of coming back now so let's kind of reduce that speed and then head into here we are currently at 50 right and then we'll pull up to it as a break i'm just wondering if to maybe put a window at, at maybe like a, another locomotive on the other end just to kind of uh oh oh oh, oh, oh too fast the, everything's fine are we charging uh, maybe if I turn the engine off and we hit the uh, track, we might charge. Oh, we are. We are charging. Beautiful. Uh, we can speed that up. But whilst that's doing um, that, let's head back over to this building, as I stated. And I think it was in the control center, I think it was. I think it was in literally this room right here. So let's head up the stairs. And it was, yep, literally right there which is the body scanner. So now we can get the body scanner and put it into our train so we can save whenever and I don't need to be at a city. And the log is right here as well. So, storage key codes. Hey, I managed to fix the storage room's doors, but it wasn't ha a, 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 a hassle. Uh, some wires were fried and I had to replace them with spare parts. There's some useful stuff in there that might help us in our journey back. P.S. I had to change the key code because everyone knew the old one. The new key code is written below. Do not forget it. 5011. So we need to now find a storage room which requires the key code. Is it the one down here? I think it is because there is a keypad. So that's 5011. And we can access this room now. And it looks like we've got a couple of smart materials, which is rare. I said rare, but like useful because technically to make a smart material you need two normal material to make one so we're kind of saving some materials and that's all uh i saw due when i was editing the video and i was like oh my god i'm gonna get so many comments going people you missed this but in fact it was only a few of you we have got a storm coming you're freezing yeah is my health gonna go down whilst i'm freezing yeah it is we can see it flashing um make sure i've got my torch off as well oh my god sprint come on come 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 oh that's going down faster and faster and faster my health if we can get inside we can keep warm oh come on come on come on there we go obviously my health's not gonna go up automatically we do need um we do have health packs for that right we've got a first aid kit right here we can drop we've only got one of them so i'm not going to utilize it on that because it's going to give us 50 percent. if i go below 50 percent health then yeah i will do um, but other than that, I'm just wondering now if we, oh, it was already open. We look at maybe adding some more things to this, uh, to this build. Um, maybe some lights, uh, cause during the, uh, the storm, it can be pretty, oh, maybe oh, I don't have the resources. I don't have the blueprints. Do I? I remember saying this last time? Um, let's, we've got a dynamo. I don't, I've got the, um, body scanner. I just need one text scrap. So I'm just wondering if we get, grab one of them by going over to the machine over here. Into the fabricator. And we need use small batteries. How many batteries do I have? A 
small map. I've got six. I think, f yeah, we could... Oh, I've only got one now. Have I got any used batteries inside inside here? It'd be nice when we get a fabricator on the actual... Um... Oh, there's a tech scrap right there. God damn it, bits. You just wasted a battery just for that. Well, whilst I'm doing that, let's get this battery that I just wasted on charge. And then I can go into build mode here. Go into others. Grab myself a body scanner and place this down. Um... Uh, maybe I'll just place it here. Just there. But I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of super looking forward to this um, game coming out. Oh, this actually gives us like Oh, no, it doesn't. It was still building. Um, but yeah, so let's actually, let's save that now. Confirm. I'll close these doors. Check on our power. Uh, 170, let's charge that up. Using the hand crank. Damn it. I love this whole combination of like... Powering it this way. It's kind of cool. Until we can automate it. 262. Oh, come on. Could have just got to keep doing this. Got to try and get them combos. It's like a mini game itself. Come on, bits. I know you can do this. The first time you did this, it was flawless. Damn it. <laughs> we will do this. I love how it lights up and everything. It goes right... Oh, I was too busy. God damn, I need some more power than that. Come on. So, what I'm doing here is I'm thinking when I spin this, oh, it will get plus one. Oh, now we've got plus three, that's four. Now we've got nine. Now, you know what I mean? But it's not. This is a total of power that's going to get added once I come off it. So, I was thinking it was going to go up a lot faster than what it is, but I guess not. Um, let me grab this battery back. Um, let's grab you. Let's head back in the train. And let's just push forward a little bit because I, I think it's still there's still a storm outside. So let's get back on our train. Let's get up out of here. Uh, have we got room in here? Um, we've got, say, nine space in there. I might have to make another storage container here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to come down to a stop here. And turn the engine off, just so we're not wasting power. And I'm just going to grab some materials out of here. He's got eight, which is perfect. I'm going to make another storage chest because we're, like, stacking on materials. And obviously, right now, our blueprints are the ones that are deteriorating, like, uh, are not allowing us to build uh, more stuff. So let's look into chest. I need smart material. Which, let me just double check if we've got any in here. We do, so let's just take one of them. Go back into build mode, go into others, and put another chest down. Uh, I'm going to put that here. Let's just do that. Rotate it. There we go. And let's put all of the materials in there. Six more batteries. Energy drink, which we're going to... We drink because we are pretty low on stamina. We have got these plants, these shadow breeze, which are good for using energy drinks. We've got some icicle ammo. Um, got all the materials in there as well. All right, let's let's uh, let's get the engines on here. Uh, let's get pushing forward and see what's beyond this next town, which we will have to... Uh, I think that's the maximum speed we can go. This is going to go down fast, isn't it? so I may as well just kind of like spin this as I'm going to help with the power come on this is like flappy bird all over again one two three four five six seven eight nine god eight let's try and get another one in one 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay, thirteen was the highest there. Oh my god, it was we're flying through power. Holy moly. We definitely need to look into something regarding uh, power here. Solar panels. We need to find the blueprints for that. And we get 50 power per minute, you just said on that, right? 50 power per solar power? Yeah, 50 power per minute. This component is not effective during storms. Not to manually do that. Okay, so we're pull, pulling back up to this place. Uh, I am going to grab the material out of the um, the miner here. I'm just wondering if he's uh, if he's going to a building over there. I would think he is. Let's just slow down. Pull up here. God, yeah. You're not going to... Oh, so there is some kind of generation going on. Maybe it's just when we're connected to the to the, li the lines. Maybe that's what it is. We kind of get natural uh, power regeneration. Right, let's get some material some out of here, and then head a little bit forward. So he's coming from somewhere, right? So I think he might be coming from that little the gap over there. So let's go into here. Also, let me know if you guys have been um, trying out this game. Um, obviously, the first this the, the first video might have got your attention to it, so maybe some of you have tried it. Let me know what you guys think uh, in the comments. You know, uh, if you guys have enjoyed, enjoyed it, if you have played it, what you you know some feedback because who knows the developers might see this and um, all that kind of good stuff. So um, we got them. Let's take them plants over there. Wasn't there? Um... Let me take some of these because I'm pretty sure in one of these buildings. It could be this one. There might be a place for us to make energy drinks. There it is. It's right here in this building. So let's go in here. And make some more of them. What's that? Oh. Um, oh, we need material as well. So four Shadow Breeze and one material. Let me just quickly grab some material. We have quite a bit of it anyway. So let me just go into here. Let's make... Um, we have nine, so let's take two of them. We can make two energy drinks, and then take that into here. And that's gonna take two, so let's get two of them going. Get two energy drinks, 60 seconds. And uh, I don't think, to be honest, we're like, we're missing anything, right? We are moving along here. I don't know if this, this demo for this game ends over here or not, but obviously we started up there when we first started last episode, and we found the city in this location and worked our way around here to this facility, so I'm going to guess there's something. But there is kind of like some red things over there. I don't know what that is, like gates, and I don't know how we access them. But we'll find out when we get over there, because we've not come across any enemies yet. Are, we, are these done? No, 18 seconds. So obviously we've been up there, we've got the solar panels, and I'm very, very curious, and so, so are you guys as well, uh, on what this is. Um, this whole halo around it, we can see that it is moving um, very, very slowly. Are you good? Yeah, you're done. And you're done. Okay, that's two energy drinks right there. I might even take one of them now, to be honest. Let's drink that. And then store some items. Just making sure my, uh, my battery's not on. Um, first aid kit, Shadow Breeze, let's store that, and we've got one energy drink on us, okay. We're going to need to get some more power up and running, so let's crank this. Obviously, I'm not going to show you this all the time, because this could get boring after a bit. Right, we're back at full power. Obviously, I might have skipped some of that. If I didn't, blame editor bits for doing that. Alright, let's move forward here. Uh, how many throttles does this have? Throttle three? Yeah, just three. Maybe that will double if we have another engine. Because I'm curious on how fast this will go. I do want to have a quick check up here real quick, to be fair. 
if this is a place of interest. Because obviously he's coming from somewhere. I'm not going to sprint. He's going up here, so... I don't know if, I'm, if I can climb this or... Or what? I'm not seeing anything. Don't even think I can climb this. Actually. He's going this way. There is plants up here, so it is intended to have a look, but... What's over this way? Okay, so it seems like there's nothing up here, but... It looks like it's just scrap. And we saw some of this, if you remember, in the first town where he was coming from. So I think this is where... Oh, that's actually a chest. But it seems this is where he grabs his scrap from. So let's take a look in here. Is there a way we can see anything on this? It's just a chest here. With some material... Some smart material. Yeah, it's just another scrap pile. So I'm just wondering if this will deplete over time. Or maybe not. But anyway, let's get back to the train and find out what their red gates are. All right, let's get back inside of here just before a... Oh, I'm stuck. What am I stuck on? Before a uh, storm comes on. And hopefully we got a bit more juice. We're back at 500. And let's store the materials that we just received. And I want to put the smart materials in the middle here kind of the uh different ones and i'm curious now what these gates are I'm, I'm kind of curious of uh if we're gonna get attacked here but i'm kind of hoping for it because i want to see the whole drone battles and all that stuff so let's move onwards and see what we've got coming up and i'm just gonna gain a little bit of power and I really, I should have faced this to the window so I can kind of see outside the window and at least give myself a little bit of juice as we're moving here. It does feel like there is a storm coming now. It has got darker, so... Storms are becoming more prominent. Just keep an eye on power here. Because I don't want to get stranded left in the open. And next thing you know... I'm going to slow down here, in fact. I want to check this wall out because I, I don't know if my train's going to go through this. Under lockdown. Interesting. Wait, just do, let's just double check that our train can go through here. It's definitely not going to be able to. Hopefully it doesn't damage the train. Yeah, definitely stops here. So let's turn the engine off. Let's hit the brakes. Let's get that charging. I'm just wondering if we can go across here on foot. But oh boy, there had to be a storm, didn't there? Can we? Yeah, we can cross that. And there is a compound over there. So I'm just wondering if we've got to head over to that compound and unlock this bridge. That's what I'm going to guess we're going to need to do. But what I'm going to do now is I'm going to wait out this storm. And as soon as it goes past, we're then going to head over the bridge. Okay, so I've been waiting for some time now, and this storm is not giving up. So I'm just going to take a run toward these buildings, and hopefully I can take shelter there. Uh, I do have a health pack on me, so um, we have that, I guess. But I'm just going to head into these buildings now, and then kind of heal up it, especially if we go below 50%. And hopefully we can find some more supplies in here. Locked control panel. Okay, so we need to find a log book to hopefully get into that. I'm just keeping an eye on my health right now. Ethan the Ranger. Let's get in here. Close that bloody door. Bloody freezing. Let's, uh, whilst I'm in here, let's consume that battery. And let's... Oh! This station doesn't have power. Okay. Good to know. Oh, there's an energy drink that either. Perfect. I did drink the second energy drink uh, that I created whilst I was in the back of the locomotive. First aid there as well. Good to know. And some icicle ammo. 
Let's grab this. And a small battery. At least I've got one consumed now in case I do need some tech from the uh, fabricator. But yeah, as you can tell, it's, it's still storming outside, actually. Oh no. Maybe we come across the as it was calming down. Typical me. You know you wait for something for so long and it never happens until you move. Typical. A uh, GT engineer. Let's head into here. So we need to get provide power to this place. We do have a log here. Uh, I've changed the control center's key code. Don't forget it and please don't share it. 6718. Okay, let's remember that. Weapon chip. Ooh. Interesting. That's the first sign of defense we've come across. Can soup and some energy drinks. And a blueprint. Okay, icicle. We need one more to find one more and we should have an icicle gun some tech scrap there this is very useful because that consumes batteries and advanced tech uh just double check okay let's head over this before the key code you know decides to leave my brain 67 18 and hopefully this unlocks the uh the bridge here so we can maneuver on oh i keep forgetting that's that um how do i cancel here uh, 67, 18. There we go. Unlock bridge. Beautiful. What else have we got in here? Anything of use? Info. Connect to network. Okay. Info. Generator. Turn on. Production a minute. 100. And power control turn on let's get all that up and running turn this facility on which now means yes we can move our train across this bridge so let me go and grab that push it along here and check out the rest of the building there's a big ice lake below us super cool it's a very, very simple concept of a game, but as I stated it as the title of the last video, it's got a lot of potential. Uh, I know it's kind of very linear because you're going to be on a track and stuff, but I'm just uh, intrigued on where and more about the lore of this game. Let's head over here now. There is a drone down there, which is... I don't know where he's going to. Oh, he's kind of just going onto that hill. And grab some material off him. I'm going to guess there's going to be another blueprint in here for the icicle. Okay. Let's turn the engine off. Get that charging. That should be fully done by the time we uh, search all of this. Also, let me just um, store the stuff in here so I can grab anything else. A weapon chip as well store that in there we've got some canned soup let's just drink the energy drink because we are below 30 percent of that canned soup gives us 50 percent good to know um uh, and let yeah let's store the tech scrap in there as well um so we've not we've checked that building we've checked that one and we've checked that one so let's check the storage turn our torch on material takes six of them some smart material and nothing else in here. Turn my torch off before somebody shouts at me. And then let's check this workstation building. There it is. I'm guessing that's the last blueprint we need. Small battery. Let's take that. Take all these smart tech. And there we go. Icicle unlocked. Beautiful. I'm surprised there's not a log in here. I do like reading the logs. And I do that with like every like open world survival game, kinda like reading all the stuff. We do have a full empty thing here, so maybe this is where I put my possible weapon, um, uh, defense, icicle turret. Uh the mechanical mechanical parts. Okay, so we have the weapon chip. We just need the mechanical parts. 
Um, which, technically, I've not seen a fabricator here. Wait, is there one inside here? I would think so. It's a workstation. There's no... No, there is no fabricator in here. Maybe, the, maybe I'm going to have to go back towards... Hold on a minute. There's, there's a station here. Did I not ch check this? Oh, here we go. That's cups. Got some things here. Can't search any of these, can we? Nope. Oh, another blueprint. Outdoor light. Okay. So, we want mechanical parts. Let's craft them. That's going to be 13 seconds. Uh, we've also got some tech scrap here. Nothing else. Four seconds. Three, two, and one. Let's get that item. Beautiful. Let's quickly save. Confirm. And then let's go and make this. We should have enough now, if I'm not mistaken. Um, to make... Yes, we do. It's going to cost us 20 power. I'm going to guess it's 20 power when we turn it on. I think I might look at placing a second engine as well, maybe. Um, let's get... Um, defense. And this. Can I put this on the roof? Locked. Okay. Maybe if we had a second... Uh, I'm just wondering where to put this, to be honest. Should I put it, like, right here at the back of the train? There we go. Oh, my God, that's big, isn't it? Whoa. So it's full 360. Wait, and if I go back onto that, it's facing the same direction. Okay. So I'm just wondering now if I have to put a chest here with the icicles in it. Or am I going to have to have the icicles on me at, at all times in case this ammo type can be used for icicle? It can penetrate medium armor. Can I store that in here? We've got five down the bottom. I don't want to fire. But I feel like I should build one. Um... Actually, I'm going to keep it in the inside because I don't want a drone destroying it. If that's a possibility, which I would think it is. Um, so let me... Drop off... Like the icicle ammo and all that kind of stuff. Store a battery. We have seven normal batteries here, so let's... Store them and carry... T use one... Oh no, carry two. First kit, first aid kit, let's store one of them. No, let's heal. Um, can soup, we'll keep that on us. And then we'll store this other material. And then store the uh, used battery as well. That into there. And this is kind of like a miscellaneous one here. So we'll store that and store the used battery. Okay, so I think that is it with this location, right? I've not found any more icicles here. Um, we do have the building down there with some materials in it. Let's have a quick look over this edge to see where he was going to. In case there's any other buildings. There's actually two more buildings down there. I wonder if there's two more two drones of them then. The track goes around there. We can't see anything regarding that. And I'm going to guess any me, any any uh, enemy drones will be maybe highlight red. Maybe like have a red eye. But I'll tell you what. Let's just take our train and move it along a little bit and push it towards these and get some uh, extra materials here. I'm just debating if to put um, a door uh, walls around my engine at this at this rate. Turn outdoor lights off. Let's turn all of them off because I might just consume power. Okay, let's turn engine on. And let's move forward here to this station. 
Yeah, there is two drones here. So this is like two double material parts here. I wonder why you're giving us more. Developers are going to be like, there's going to be a reason you need them. Now we have the article on the blueprint. It's kind of typical game knowledge now. Wow, that's a lot of materials in here. 21? Okay, I feel like we, maybe we should put a, a room around this, maybe with a door here. I think I'm going to do that, to be honest. Wait, can I not put that there because of... Am I going to have to make an... Uh, okay, so we have to kind of leave that open there then. Okay, so let's put that to there. Turn you there. That's going to be a door. I guess we can put wall here. Window there. That's going to have to be... A do I should really put the doors in first, right? Um, stairs, doors. Yeah, I feel like I should put these in first. Yeah, let's put it kind of... Let's put that... The, the, no, not enough smart material. God damn it. I think I've got some smart material in here. I do. Let's take two of them. I may as well take the tech scrap as well. I don't think I'll need the tech scrap, but we are coming across a storm right now. And I am building, so... Where's the door? There it is. So let's put you there. I don't think I'm going to have enough room to put that curved window there, am I? No, because it's clipping through that. So if I was to put that there, got myself a window there. Wait, did that corner not get put in? Oh, it did. I think I'm going to have to move this engine. Locomotive engine. Hopefully I can. I can. Let's kind of keep shifting forward. That works. Let's just get inside. Wait. Let's close that. That should help against it, right? Um, And then... That we have that. Let's get a roof on this thing. We are going to need a door here as well. Wait, can I put a door there? I don't think I can because of this, can I? A little off ramp. There we go. I'm kind of liking the look of this, you know. So let me now go into here and add the body scanner back in. I can put that next to the door. Oh, I don't have enough smart material. Uh, smart material. Let's just craft one of them. That should give us the ability to, to make the uh, save point. And then I should be able to then place this down in. Oh, flashbang into this corner. Do a cheeky little save and then get things stored away here. Um, store, store, store. Uh, use to more batteries. We're going to do them. Let's store the tech scrap. And now you guys don't have to wait for all these batteries to be. Do we have a charger here? Oh, it's in that building over there, isn't it? But you guys don't have to wait. Let me get my... Let's eat some canned soup here and get my stamina back up. But like I was saying, you guys don't have to wait for this. You, The power of editing. You guys get to wait. I've got to wait seven minutes now and get all these charged. So uh, I'll be back when all of these are charged. All right. All batteries have been charged. Time to get back to this bloody train and move on and oh guess what we've got another storm of course we have and i've noticed as well is if we step into like the snow here it, you know it classes it as deep snow but at least we can go into here and it slows it slows our pace down that's what was uh, i was trying to figure out last time let's get back in here i'm just wondering if should i close all of these in case we do see enemies and i'm gonna run through here open this door open this door open that door i've got hiccups i'm just wondering to leave that second door open there uh, but hopefully enemies can't get inside and then let's store some of these batteries in here so let's give us two two and then let's head on our way and see what's up ahead we've got full power so now we're exploring into unknown territory i'm going to quickly grab some more materials from here uh, real quick before we move on uh, because this one had like 20 plus in it, so I'm guessing this one must have as well. So we might as well fill up what we've got. And then technically, with our expansion we've just built, 
is uh, is kind of you know free of charge if you think about it. Let's turn off the engine always, just so we can uh, get some uh, juice. Oh my god, this has got 16 in it now. That's got 16 in it, and I'm gonna get this one. that's gonna have more in it as well. Might have to look at using a med kit here. Has this got any in it? Oh, I think he might be full. That's why he's not moving. Oh my god, he is. We're taking all of this. Unless he stays in here now because of the weather. Interesting. Okay, we need to eat some... Uh, eat something. Yeah, my stamina is low. Let's get inside. We've got some snacks in here, right? I'm pretty sure... Oh, do we not have any? Oh, damn. Let's store all of them in there. Let's store all the material we have in there as well. Let's take out... Um, let's get four. We do have... Nine of these, so we can take out eight. Take two more energy drinks. And two of them. Okay, so let's go and get two more energy drinks. Let's turn this engine on. Let's back this up so I'm not walking in the... Uh... Oh! No! Oh, no. It's the first time we've died. We lost some of our inventory. Okay, I only lost one plant. I didn't fully read that tutorial that popped up saying about the stamina. Okay, stamina is more important than anything else then. Oh, damn it. Okay, let's... Wait. Oh my god, I lost the first aid packs. I actually lost the first aid packs. Crap. Okay, let's back up this train. Oh, no. I don't even know if we can make these. Oh, this is a disaster. This is an actual disaster. And I need to get my stamina up. So we need to drink. Like ASAP. So let's get them being made. Oh, I thought... Oh, we lost one, didn't we? I'm pretty sure there's some more outside. Can we make health packs? We can't. We can't... Oh, this is not good. I'm probably going to die again. We're going to have to head to the next location just so we can... Find... Find some health kits. Let's grab these plants, though, so I can get a second energy drink going. Two, three. There's some more over there on that corner as well, so I'm going to grab them. Let's grab as much as we can. I'm going to need to grab some more materials to make these energy drinks. I'm going to walk on the rail here. It seems to be faster than the snow. And then we take that out of there. Put in another one. And put in another one. That's three. We'll drink two of them now. In fact, I'll actually drink one of them now. And then we'll wait for these two. And then we need to get to the next location. And hopefully there's some health packs. Because if we get under attack. And I'm literally on the on this turret. And I take one hit. I don't know how much damage the uh, drones are going to take off us. Alright, energy drinks complete. Let's drink that. And then kind of move on with our day. Let's get these doors closed. I'm actually going to leave that open, to be honest, just for ease of access. We're good for power. We are. Let's store the materials. Store the plants. Got two of them left. Small batteries here. We've got six. We've got two ready there. Uh, okay. Let's move on. Let's grab the materials that was in that building there. And then head on and see what's around the corner. So we'll grab all of these. 
bada bing, bada bosh. I don't think I'm going to have enough chest space to accompany all of these, which I definitely, definitely do not. So I'm just wondering, can I make another storage here? I can if I got some more smart stuff. Which means I've got to reverse again. Oh boy. So let's make some more smart material. Make another chest. Store all of that material. Head down the train track. Grab more of the material. Store that in there. Wind up the power so we're fully recharged. And then be on our way. So I don't know what to expect going up here. Well, I thought we were going to go into that mountain then. So this is all new terrain here for us now. We have got the icicle turret. We've not come across any enemies as of yet. I'm kind of expecting them soon. Got to keep an eye on this power right now as well. Let's crank some more power as we're moving. Got a good 58. Oh, what's this? I definitely feel like I want to come across something. Oh, a tunnel. Interesting. This might get a little dark. I'm just wondering inside this tunnel, is there going to be any doorways that can lead us into some, like, engineering rooms? I do want to charge right now because we are pretty low. But I want to keep an eye on what we're coming up against. Let's kind of slow down here a little bit. Oh yeah, this is dark. Having some exterior lights here will definitely help. Well, let's slowly push through. Oh, and it's still going on. Damn it. We're getting close to running out of power, so I want to keep going with this. It feels like I'm starting to see light at the end of the tunnel, but I'm not. Okay, so we've just come into this area. Turn the engine off. We're in some sort of cave. There is an access panel at that gate. But I think before we move on anywhere, I need to keep my... Uh, I need to keep charged here because I'm about to run out. Forgetting where the thing is because there's windows. Wait, that is a window. Wait, that is. Wait. Hello? There we go. Right, so let's. Let me charge to full. And then we'll check out like the gates. Right, I've charged it just enough. I got to about 350. Let's just kind of push here a little bit. So I want to get to this door and it can charge whilst I'm having a little look around here. Alright, so we've got a gate to unlock. Let's turn that off. Is that still going to charge? It is. Okay. What have we got here? A blueprint. Solar panel. Beautiful. Solar plates. Nice. Small batteries. An energy drink. Let's drink that now. And a log as well. Log entry. An hour has passed since we arrived. We're so close to the main sectors. Just behind this wall. I can't imagine what it looks like without all those people. But at least it'll be warm there. Leaving this place was never going to be easy. But it's turning out to be much harder than we thought. The tunnel gate is broken. The GT, G, GITI and the other engineers are working on fixing it. Hopefully, they'll have it up and running soon. Interesting. Okay. So hopefully we can... I'm going to guess we're going to have to follow this cable here. This is going to deny us, isn't it? Yeah, power is down. Okay, let me use a small battery here because I'm going to have to keep my torch on. Got another log entry is it as well and another blueprint. The primary power, power grid is no longer connected to the tunnel gate, which is broken. However, I've managed to connect it to a battery in the nearby tunnel. 
If you're reading this and want to enter sector 87, follow the cable to turn on the battery output. Be careful though, you don't want to wake up the scout drone. Ooh. Okay. So there is a crouch, just keep that in mind. We have no form of defense right now, so I'm going to guess we're going to have to stay out of its proximity. And I don't know what these look like. So there is another train. Oh, it's getting dark. Don't know where this guy is. Turrets here, some engines. Guessing that's the battery turned on. There's the other blueprints. We've got solar panels now. Weapon chips. An energy drink. We'll take that and a small battery as well. Okay. I have not seen the scout drone. I thought he might have been here. Unless we're going to get a big red alert here in a second. It doesn't seem like it. Unless he's behind the lock gate. Alright, let's get back onto the train. Ooh! I'm not going to lie to you if I said I was a little bit kind of scared there. I say a little scared, but like... I didn't know what to expect, because we've not seen any of them yet. Uh, I need to use that battery. Um, Where is the battery? Battery, 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 small battery use. Right, solar panel. Uh, power, solar panel. I need two smart plating and a mechanical parts. Let's open this gate. Let me just store that in there. Store material in there. Weapon chip. And use small battery as well. Store them. So we've still got two batteries there. We've got an energy drink on us. I still could do with a first aid kit. Let's unlock the gate. Hopefully my train should be charged for us to get through here. Yeah, we're 500. All right, let's turn this on. Turn my torch off. Get moving. And see what is on the other end of this tunnel. Which is the end of the prologue. Thank you for playing Heat Death. We hope you enjoyed the game and we would love to hear your feedback. Please join our Discord. Da 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 da. Well, I did not expect that to end there, if I have to be honest. I thought we might have had some form of combat. Just because we have this turret. It's. That's so annoying. Oh my god. I was so expecting to come across some drones or to see the combat in this prologue or just a little teaser of it. But that's so disappointing now. I'm not going to come outside the tunnel here and make sure there's like nothing I've missed in this location, but there's no drones. Well, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed these two videos. I thought it was going to go on for a little bit longer. Um, so hopefully... We hear more about this game soon and we can dig deeper into it. So, and my train just ran out of power. Perfect timing. But thank you so much for watching. Check out my other content right here. And as always, keep smiling.